Hello friends, today I will tell you how to install Postgres on Windows system. First we have to download it. In Explorer type Postgres SQL download for Windows 10. Click on Postgres SQL. Click on download the installer. It will take us to EDB website. Click on Windows 86 64 bit version and click download. It will as the download starts it's around 195 MB it will take a little bit of time to download once it download double click on it and installation will start before this please like this video subscribe my channel for latest update on QGIS We'll use this Postgres in QGIS also. Just double click on Postgres SQL. Installation is start. Keep all that default. Check all four options. Assign a password. Keep the port default and installation will start. As you reach at the end, it will ask for a stack builder option to download extensions of Postgres. We have to download a Postgres extension for that. So we have to check the stack builder option and click next. It will ask for install Postgres. Select the Postgres we have installed and select the special extension for this. Please subscribe my channel and click the bell button now you can see stack builder option click finish post sql next select the special extension postgs it will download the postgs to the location where you will i am downloading it out download click next it will install once finish open the postgres from start program PG admin 4 it will open in browser click on server you see click on database for creating a new database create database I am going to name it Dehradun database once the database created we have to add extension of PostGIS Create extension PostGIS, name PostGIS. As we add the PostGIS, a new table added to the schema, name public. You can see in tear table, a special reference table. We can check all the reference systems here. Type the select star from special reference system. It will list all the projections installed in PostGIS. If you want to see particulars then we have to type where SRID equal to SRID number. I am checking 7755 which is in India LCC projection by default. You can see now we are going to add some post shape file to the Postgres. So we have to add, there is a PostGIS safe import export manager in start program Postgres folder. Enter the Postgres connection details. Select the files by clicking add button. Select, I have Dehradun district layers, building place, railway, road, water, water area, select all layers. Just enter the SRID here. As these shape files are in geographical projection, so geographical projection layer have SRID 4326. This is the SRID number for geographical projection. We can enter here also or we can assign later. We can leave zero here. I'll tell you in next video how to assign this SRID to the existing layers 
now all layers are imported right click and refresh the table you will see all layers are loaded now we will open these layers in QGIS just switch to QGIS you will see we have to create a new connection of PostGIS in browser panel in browser panel right click click new connection enter the name connection name you can give it to any name host is localhost 5 port is 5432 database name which we had given in PostGIS and click ok it will ask for username and password enter the username and password in drop down you will see the connection and all the layers are here by just double clicking on a layer it will add to the map canvas add all layers as you see you when you saving a project it will saved in a file system in a directory we can save this project in postgres also for this we have to check an option in connection details we have to check the last option say allow saving loading qgis project into a database check this option and project save save to postgres sql type the project name here you can save the project here in postgres as you refresh the connection in browser panel you will see a project loaded in save project saved in postgres just start a new project and load from postgres double click on project it will automatically load all layers which we have have in our project now we can assign a symbology for this we i had already made a video how to assign symbology we can save this symbology in postgres also i will tell you how to save the symbology in postgres i am going to assign a symbology to this building yes right click on it it will open properties style save as default it will ask for where you want to save click on database source it will store this symbology into database now i will tell you how to copy symbology from one layer to another layer i have the same layers in geo package database i am loading that layer and copy the style from that layer building layer you have to just right click on layer style copy style all categories if you want to copy all categories or you can say only copy symbology label symbology anything you can i am just copy all symbol category just copy that click on the layer which you want to assign a new symbology right click on layer style paste all style category and then double click on it and it will save the symbology to the postgres like here you can see it's building this style paste style all style category now the symbology of building changes to 3d you will click 3d just right click here style style save as default it will ask for we have already assigned a previous symbology to it now it will ask for to replace the existing symbology replace click on yes and you can see we have added the data and displayed in qgis thank you for watching